Why is Ryan Gosling the dream of woman? Hey, my name is Mo Bassi, and in today's video, we're gonna talk about the characteristics of Ryan Gosling and what makes him so attractive to women so that you can become a higher value, more attractive man yourself. Starting off with number one is he is very vulnerable. Oh, this place is gigantic. Yeah, a gigantic piece of crap. <laughs> it is. But I'm gonna buy it one day. I'm gonna fix it up. All it needs is a new floor and new walls and roof. Is that all? And plumbing and electric. And furniture. Yeah, it's some furniture. But it's right on the water. And there's a big old barn up there. I could turn that into my workshop. Well, what about me? Now, don't I get any say in this? Do you want to say in this? Yes, I would. Throughout any shows or movies that he plays, he is very open and vulnerable about his life, his past, his future, what he's done, what he hasn't done. And vulnerability is an extremely attractive characteristic. The reason why is because when we used to be in tribes back in the day, if you were vulnerable and you shared everything, your thoughts, your emotions, your desires, and your wants, and you directly communicated that, it meant that everybody else in the tribe could trust you based off of the future. If in the future you had any thoughts or you thought something and you had anything that you were thinking about, any emotions or feelings that came up, any desires or wants that came up, they could count on you to be direct, honest, and trustworthy. They could count on you that they can know that whatever you're saying is exactly with pure intentions and with pure honesty. And this honesty allows them to be able to trust you. It allows them to understand that this person never lies and therefore we could trust this person. And the people that we trust, we tend to like more. We tend to find more attractive. And so throughout the entire shows or movies that he plays, he usually plays characters where he is very vulnerable with other people. Number two, and you see this in his interviews a lot, is he's very soft-spoken. He's very chill, laid back. He's very playful. He's never taking things too seriously. Young dancers, they can be qu quite vicious. It's a cutthroat business. <laughs> I had to get out. <laughs> I, I was on some kind of a Canadian star search and uh, I somehow made it to the finals and uh, my main competition were these two uh, twins who were tap dancers and they were dancing to Phil Collins' uh, Two Hearts. Cool. And they had big heart-shaped bows and they were just, uh, <laughs> they were the ones to beat. So <laughs> I remember, uh, you know, wishing them luck and going on stage and I was getting ready to start. I was dancing the uh, Everybody Dance Now by CNC Music Factory, mm -hmm. of course. Yeah. And I'm getting ready to start, which is This Is How You Started. A winning dance number, if you want to know. Get out of your hands, and I, and I, Go ahead, go up. And I, and I look up, up, up. into the, into the uh, just off stage, and the, the two twins are standing there like the twins from The Shining. <laughs> and they're just going like this. And this is extremely attractive because nobody wants to be around someone who is hard-edged, who is um, not going with the flow of life. Because at the end of the day, Life isn't that serious. It's not, uh, you shouldn't be taking things too seriously as a person. You know, nothing at the end of the day really matters. And so the fact that he's very chill and laid back, the fact that he's very soft spoken, the fact that he's playful and he can just freely express himself is extremely attractive towards women. And last but not least, which is what I think is the main point, is he gives women the silent hero fantasy. Right? And what this means is he's usually uh, the silent hero with the troubled past, but with a heart of gold. But okay, right. you want the bike in it too? Yeah, just all, you know what I'm saying? Just capture the mood. There's a nice bike. The bike's part of the family. You want another one? You sure I should take it when she's crying? <laughs> That's a good trick. <laughs> 
You know, even though he's had a troubled past, even though he's dealt with all of these traumas and all these things, he has a heart of gold. He's very open and he loves people and he cares for people. And he's basically the fantasy guy uh, with problems who women can actually fix, can actually save. Because at the end of the day, there's a lot of women who are fixers. There's a lot of women who are attracted to men that they can save or fix or improve because it actually increases their chances of survival and reproduction in the future if they're with a man who can improve in status over time. So they might be with a man now who has lower status, but in the future, if he has higher status and they were on that ride with them, then they're going to be able to get the resources and the goods from that man uh, while they were on that ride. And so women are attracted to men that they can essentially fix or save or improve and grow with. And so the fact that he has all of these problems and this traumatized past, this troubled past, but he still has this heart of gold, gives women hope that he can be saved, that he can be fixed, that they can grow with him. And so this makes him extremely, extremely attractive. And I think this is the main reason why Ryan Gosling, even though he's not like, he's pretty good looking and he, he does have like the characteristics of an ideal male, but he's not the best looking man in the world. He's not the most jacked looking man in the world. He's not the most high status man in the world, but yet women absolutely love him. And I think it's because of this very reason. So to recap is he's very vulnerable, which means that he's honest, which means that you can trust him over the long time. He's very soft spoken, chill, laid back and playful, which means that you can be yourself around him. You can express yourself around him and you're not going to be judged. And last but not least is he gives women the silent hero fantasy. He's the guy with the troubled past, but he's got the heart of gold and he's a man who can be saved. He's a man who can be fixed. He's a man that women can improve and grow with. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to click that subscribe button and that thumbs up down below. It really helps out this channel. And if you have any ideas of who you want me to break down, then just simply pop it in the comment section down below and we will talk soon. Take care.